y'all welcome back to my channel go ahead and give me a thumbs up for being back girl come on come on just bring in the love y'all because i'm really needing it right now i'm so happy for the holidays and i have been doing some shopping girl and my favorite kind of shopping actually is thrifting i got some really good items for fall and winter and i want to share that with y'all today i'm glad y'all came back to just hang out with me so if you are into thrifting just like me girl stick around and please stay until the end because i'm giving y'all some of my personal tips when it comes to thrifting so you can have the best experience and you can get your hands on the best unique items okay y'all so the first thing that we have here are actually these pants that I have on they're kind of like um, a linen material I would say I'm very cute this is like this cream soft color they look linen but they have a lot of stretch to it very comfortable even though they're high waist I can still sit down be comfortable eat my little food girl and okay so next y'all we have this beautiful it's kind of like a pastel pink shade um a sweater obviously we are in the winter season so I definitely wanted to pick up some sweaters and like really fall items as well so this is really cute you can tuck it in very comfortable it's like that thick kind of wool material but it's very soft one thing i like about sweaters is i love the fact that you can cinch it in with a belt if you need it to like and you can have like a really cute moment i want to get up close so you guys can see kind of like the material very comfortable and cozy and i love the color the color is like brown. this is like this really nice what kind of caught my attention with this sweater is, are these beautiful cute little polka dots i thought this was so cute like you can wear this with a skirt it's playful but to me it's not too much so cute and like unique i love the unique finds that you come across in goodwill so, so next y'all we have this really nice cable knit sweater i think this is what they call it or so anyway I got this in black, girl. I was going off with the sweaters because I was not about to be playing in the streets with this weather, with this cold weather. I love the cold, but I like to be warm. Obviously, with everything that's going on, I do not want to get sick. So I racked up on a lot of sweaters. So, oh my God, y'all. First of all, super cute. This is actually a Ralph Lauren top. And um, when I saw it, I just knew that the quality would be good, but also the fit. So, I mean, no belt, nothing. It's already like hugging my natural waist here. Super cute. I just love this sweater. And black is my favorite color. Cute. I love how long. We love this. I love that the sleeves are long. Super cute. I love the V cut here. I think that adds something like super feminine and really cute. So yeah, I honestly got this sweater for the color. This is a medium that I have on and I just could not say no. <laughs> it's this really nice cream and I just love it. It has like a nice thick turtleneck to keep my neck warm. I feel like this is a basic and you always need like those neutrals and creams and blacks in your wardrobe. And um, this is like a staple color for the holidays. So I'm super happy. That I got my hands on this. Another beautiful sweater that I got. It has like these really pretty ridges on it. A high neck. It's not quite a turtleneck. I would call it like a mock neck. I love, love, love that detail when it goes up high. Definitely tuck it in. And yeah, I love this. And I know it's giving like um auntie vibe, but honestly, something that I can also wear in the springtime. So this is something that I picked up. Because I know it's going to be very, very versatile for me at Goodwill. When I go thrifting, let's say, you know, right now it's obviously the winter season, fall, winter season. If I see something that I feel like will be good in my wardrobe for the following season, which after winter we have spring, then I will grab it. Um, to me, this is like a really cute, just staple item for color and like these cute designs that I was telling y'all about. And honestly something may look like it's not your style but you can style these items any way you want you can cut it you can tie it up this is something that you can easily add sleeves to if you want to i'm very much so a diy girl so i see something and i see different possibilities and that's the great thing about thrifting is you find these unique items that you can create whatever style that you want is that yeah if you see something that may fit another season 
If you see something for fall, but you're in spring, get it while you can because it's a unique item and it's, you know, it's not guaranteed that you'll see that item again for the fall because most people shop prior to the season, right? And I don't typically wear pink, but I did I did like this color. And like I said, I like these cute little details here. So that's why I picked that up. Very cute. Very cute. This top is super pretty. Um, even when I saw this in Goodwill, I was like, oh my goodness, like the color is gorgeous, obviously. It has these strings, you can tie it in the front if you like, or um, and you can tie it in the back. So really like this really beautiful, what do we call it? Like this very silk material. It feels really good like um on camera it's coming out orange but it's really like this rough shade it is gorgeous for the holidays i mean oh my goodness you can wear this with anything but any kind of um, neutrals i will probably wear with this top I, I love it even when i saw it i was like okay i gotta have it even though it was medium <laughs> love 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 this um, so this is another item that i got from Goodwill. It's like this really beautiful floral like velvet outfit. I mean, it didn't come with a belt or anything, but it definitely is a blazer. It is an extra large, so it's really big, but I love that look. And it's kind of like, yeah, it's long enough to be a dress, but wearing a belt with this and cinching your waist in with some nice knee-high or thigh-high boots, this is unique. Like these are the items that like I typically go for. I'm not really into patterns as much, but this to me was just gorgeous. I feel like the cream color underneath kind of settles the drama of the flowers. So to me, this is amazing. It's different, it's beautiful. The velvet is still giving like that holiday luxury lush look to me. And then you have the burgundies and the greens throwing like some beautiful makeup and yes girl and cinch that waist in with some boots honey this is cute this is so cute i don't want to show too much <laughs> very cute blazer i love the detail in here where they have like this crisscross little situation so you can wear this with some nice pants um whatever really so i got this black it's like a crop blazer and you can tuck this in if you like i kind of like it down i don't know why but see what it's giving girl i personally would wear this with an all black outfit some nice high waist black jeans and a black top looking for different items at goodwill i always keep in mind pairing them with my current wardrobe so like this i know i already have some high waist black jeans I know I already have boots, so this would be easy for me. So I got some more of like, it's like a cream color dress pants from Goodwill. I feel like I just can't have enough of these because I love cream dress pants, apparently. So yeah, I really like these. Just a nice basic. This is a linen material as well, but it's not as stretchy as my other one. Okay, dress that I got. I want to show you guys up close what it looks like. It's this literally beautiful silk dress this is another outfit i feel like you can wear for fall like with a blazer if it's super cold outside but honestly it's beautiful i'm going to show you guys what it looks like in the photo in the full look mirror because it goes down pretty long y'all i literally found the perfect suit cream suit and i already told you guys how much i love cream for winter okay straight from goodwill you can literally wear this definitely belted you can wear this with a turtleneck it's so freaking cute it's so cute i'm gonna show you guys okay the camera is picking up a little bit so it's this hot pink colored sweater dress it has pink glitter also in the dress and you can pull it down you can definitely adjust it how you want to super cute once I saw this girl, I was like, okay, Goodwill, like y'all taking it to another level. I've definitely found basics at Goodwill, but nothing to this extent. I just love this a lot. But if you wanted to wear this for New Year, be an option. It's very cute. Very cute. Okay, y'all. So now I'm going to be giving you guys the best thrift tips for your next shopping day, okay? 
So the first tip is have an idea of what it is that you're looking for. What helps me have a successful thrift day is I have an idea of what I want to add to my current wardrobe. Whether that be shirts, sweaters, skirts, pants, or even shoes, or even jewelry. Also, this helps with budgeting as well because when I go into Goodwill, I literally want to buy everything. So, <laughs> having an idea of what it is that you're looking for definitely helps you stay on budget as well. So, that brings me to tip number two, and that is be mindful of pricing and also additional sales within the store. So, in most Goodwill stores, they may have color of the day is green, and whatever items are tagged green, you can get a discount off of those items. Make sure you guys are asking the associates, like, what's the color of the day, and they'll be able to tell you so you can get that additional discount. That is very important. This next tip is make sure you are wearing the appropriate items to actually try on clothes in the store if you need to, okay? We just want to keep in mind that majority of these clothes are donated uh, by people in the community. Most of these items may or may not have been washed before they actually brought them to the store. So just for cleanliness, be really mindful of that. I like to wear leggings and um, like a little t-shirt if I need to try on any clothes which also brings me to inspecting the clothes. Now that is another tip that I have for you guys. Make sure you inspect the clothes thoroughly. Um, and what I mean by that is if you're looking at a jacket and the jacket instantly catches your eye, okay? Make sure you inspect the item. See if it has any loose threads, see if there's any stains, see if there's any stains around the neckline. Make sure there are no rips or no tears in it. If they are easy fixes or if you can get an additional discount off and it's something that you feel that you can deal with at home, I would definitely say go ahead and you know get that item. Well, obviously we know these are secondhand clothes. Some of the clothes are also brand new as well and I've taken, I've donated clothes to Goodwill that I bought. I could not wear it for whatever reason. I'll just take it right to Goodwill. So um, you never know what the case may be. Make sure you guys are inspecting those items so when you get home, you know you have the best thrifting experience possible, okay? So if you guys are interested in more clothing hauls from me, please check out my She In Haul. If you wanna know how I got this blonde hair, just click my Perfect Blonde for Brown Girls video right here. And I will see you guys very soon. Bye. Bye.